welcome to our virtual closing program for this year's National Arts Month 2022. To formally start, let us all say a prayer and please remain on the line for our Philippine National Anthem. <laughs> presensya sa imong balaang espiritu. Nagpasalamat kami sa imong pagdugang sa among kinabuhi ug paghatag og laing kay gayunan aron sa pagdayeg ug pag-alagad niya kanimo. Salamat sa mga grasya ug kaluoy nga imong gipakita kanamo. Salamat sa among mga pamilya ug kahigalaan. Salamat sa walay punong nimong paghatag kanamo. Ginoong Dios, nasayod kami nga ikaw ang nagdumala sa tanan diri sa kalibutan. Kami nagapanalangin na ikaw ang buktong tinugdan sa among panglawas o kaayuhan. Kami naghahangyo sa padayong nimong pag-uban ka namin, na ikaw nakakita sa among mga nahiagumo. Kuha ang kahadlok nga among gibati o bukusa kami sa iyong proteksyon. Makagagahog namong amahan, among ihangadya kanimo ang among kinabuhi karong adlawan. Iyay ang mataglakang namo karon o ang imong pagbuot mo ay matuloy. Hinaot imong bendisyonan ang among mga pamilya o mga kahigalaan. Bendisyon ni usab ang mga leader sa edukasyon o mga magtutudlo. Ipadayon ang paghatag kanila o kusun. Sa panghinaot na dili mawala ang ilang buko, kainit o pagsabot. Sa panahon nga makaplag sila o hagit, Hatagi o giyahi kaming tanan, sumala sa imong hingpit nga plano sa among mga kinabuhi. Kining tanan, among gipangayo, sa ngala ni Yesu Cristo, among ginoo o pagluluwas. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, let's all welcome the Vax Dance Troop in their grand protection number.
According to John Lugo, art is unquestionably one of the purest and highest elements in human happiness. It trains the mind through the eye and the eye through the mind. As the sun colors flowers, so does art colors life. You doctor news our virtual audience. I am Silito Iyas. And I am George III Kulen Kulen. And we are your virtual hosts this afternoon. So how was your day, Silito? My day was full of excitement as I watched the entries of our dear students of Ba'i City National Science High School. That despite the pandemic, we were given a chance to showcase our talents. How about you, George? I feel so good today. I feel so relieved that we are witnessing the beauty of art in this National Arts Month. 2022. Anyway, let's proceed to our main program. So to unite us with our words of welcome, allow me to call on the energetic and ever supportive school principal one of Bay City National Science High School. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mrs. Carmelita C. Valencia. Let's give her a virtual applause, everybody. The Bay City Division staff, headed by the School Division Superintendent, Dr. Arnold P. Aguilar, and the Assistant School Division Superintendent, Mr. Arnold A. Andana, Bay City Division representative in the person of our Chief Education Supervisor, School Governance and Operation Division, Chief Mr. Emmanuel B. Garcia, Acting Chief Curriculum and Implementation Division, Mrs. Cherry B. Catagman, and Division MAPI Coordinator, Mr. Arturo F. Atlético Jr. To the Bashan's family, most especially to the organizer for this activity, Mr. Carmelo A. Hamita Jr., the School Cultural Affairs Coordinator, and Mrs. Amelin A. Babor, the School MAPI Coordinator, good afternoon. In accordance to Presidential Proclamation No. 683, signed in 1991, the National Arts Month celebration spread headed by the National Commission for Culture and Arts through its subcommission for Culture and the Arts highlights the importance of acknowledging exceptional and artistic activities, promoting artistic movement, and expresses as embodied in the form of visual arts, architecture, and allied arts, music, dance, cinema, dramatic arts, and literary arts. This year's theme, Sining ng Pagasa, aims to recognize arts as a source and expression of hope, as shown in the creative ways we respond to the effect of the pandemic, natural calamities, and other social realities, as well as the arts role in improving our community life as Filipino. By City National Science High School proudly showcases the best talents of our learners, according to Sergey J. L. Garcia, being an artist is not just about putting pencil to paper nor brush to canvas. An artist is an individual compelled to create meaningful art and help his peers blossom into better individuals. My salute to our school cultural arts coordinator, Mr. Carmelo Hamilton Jr., and his creative team, highlighting the brilliance of our Sinai students. Welcome to our humble celebration as we join the National Arts Month 2022. Thank you and good afternoon. Thank you so much, Mom Carms, for that heartwarming words. At this point, it's time to recognize the people behind this program. Please watch this.
You will be entertained by a dance number from the selected grade 12 students. You will be dancing the official national dance of the Philippines, Karen Yosa. Number. Thank you guys! At this point, let us all lend our ears and open our hearts to the Division Education Program Supervisor in Mapet, Mr. Arturo Adriatico Jr. for his message. A virtual applause, everybody. All the parents, learners, faculty and staff, and most especially, for the organizer of this activity, Sir Carnilo A. Hamito Jr., the School Cultural Affairs Coordinator, to Mrs. Amelin A. Pabon, the School Mapping Coordinator, and to the very good friend of mine, Mrs. Carmelita C. Valencia, the School Principal of Bay City National Science High School. Every month of February, we celebrated National Arts Month. But sad to know, that we did not comply this in previous year due to the onslaught of the pandemic. It was very challenging for us teachers to implement the activities which is difficult to achieve. But this year, 2022, thankfully the future seems to look brighter with decreasing virus cases in our country and even in our province. Indeed, there is so many reasons to hope 
for the better. This year's the theme of the National Arts Month celebration is Sinning ng Pag-asa, which aims to use arts as a tool of expressing the source of hope. Artworks show that creativity ways we responded to the pandemic, natural calamities, and even social ills. Today, you give hope to your learners by celebrating Arts Month and letting them to enjoy and have fun by participating in different contest categories in your school, which enhances, develop, and even discovering the hip hidden talents and skills of our learners. And I consider this a good or best practices in your school. For this, I commend Bay City National Science High School for the job well done. Congratulations and God bless us all. Thank you so much, Sir Adriatico. We are grateful of your presence, Sir. Now, we have finally come to the moment we've all been waiting for, the announcement and awarding of winners. But of course, a contest will not be a contest without judges, so it's time to meet our board of judges. Our first judge is a teacher tree from Okyot Elementary School. Ladies and gentlemen, let us all meet Mr. Archie Fortuna. Our second judge is a teacher fee from South Central School. How about the virtual applause to Mrs. Venus Marie Ketuba? Our next judge is a teacher tree from Mavir Laxinawan Memorial High School. She's no other than Mrs. Florie Mae Aragonas. Our last judge is a teacher tree from Bai City National Science High School. Our resident judge, Mrs. Joanna May Usoy. Our panel of judges are indeed well chosen. At this point, I'm giving now the platform to the different contest chair for the reading of guidelines and presentation of winners. May I present to you the contest mechanics for this year's Basha Sika. First, this contest is open to all bona fide students of Bay City National Science High School. Second, one participant, one entry only. Third, each contestant must select an opium song, may it be in Tagalog or Cebuano only. Fourth, contestants may use minus one or any preferred musical instrument. Fifth, no medley or mashup of song allowed. Sixth, the duration of the performance must be within three to five minutes only. Seven, each contestant is required to shoot a video while performing the song. Any devices are allowed to be used for shooting and editing. Note, no vocal and song editing is allowed. Eight, entries must be submitted to this Gmail account. Roxanmay.thegoodlot at deped.gov.ph on or before February 23, 2022 at 12 noon. With this file format, name, underscore, grade level, and section. Ninth, entries will be judged according to the following criteria. Voice quality and presentation, 40%. Showmanship, 20%. Song choice and musicality, 20%. Diction, 10%. Attire and setup, 10%. For a total of 100%. And lastly, all entries will be posted on our official Facebook page, Saihai Ba'is National Arts Month. Winners will be announced during the virtual closing program on February 28, 2022. And this year's winners for National Arts Month's Bashan Sikat. Third place. Umuwi ka na baby Hinaako siya na hinawala ka Second place. Umuwi ka na baby 
Congratulations, everyone! Let me read to you the contest mechanics and criteria for Masining Nasunay Side. 1. The contest is open to all bona fide students of Ba'i City National Science High School. 2. The essay must be based on the theme, Sining ng Pag-asa. 3. The write-up should contain 300 to 500 words. 4. The essay should be written in English or in Filipino. 5. The competition will only accept original essays. Previously published essays are not permitted. Plagiarism of any kind will resort in participants' disqualification. 6. Write-ups will be judged based on the following criteria. Content and relevance to the theme, 40%. Originality, 25%. Composition and creativity, 20%. Persuasion or impact, 15%, with a total of 100%. 7. Judge's decision is final and irrevocable. 8. Interest must be submitted on or before February 23, 2022 at 12 noon. 9. Judges will select three winners which is for first, second, and third. 10. Submit your entries at masiningnasanaisai at gmail.com with a format, complete name, underscore, your grade level, and section. 11. All interests will be posted in our official Facebook page, Sai Hai Bais National Arts Month. Winners will be announced during the virtual closing program on February 28, 2022. And the winners for this year's Masining Nasa Nai Sai. Third place goes to... Second place goes to First place goes to Congratulations Ladies and gentlemen, may we present to you the context mechanics of Masaram. This contest is open to all bona fide students at Bali City National Science High School. One participant, one entry only. All submitted, submitted entries must be originally designed by the participants. The base of the design must be a plain face mask. Participants may use any material such as, but not limited to beads, burda, laces, plastic materials provided it is safer to be worn in the face. All materials will be provided by the participants. The design may be freehand and or machine made. The participant shall submit a one-minute video containing or showcasing the way how or she created the mask and the details of the mask. The designer or user chosen model will do the rampa wearing the final output. The participant have the right to select the music that is that would be fit to the theme. Participant must submit their entries to this Gmail account. Amya Marshall Jr. at gmail.com following this file name format. Complete name, underscore grade level and section. Entries will be judged according to the following criteria. Quality of workmanship, 40%. That includes neatness and the good use of technique. 
Originality, 30%. That includes on how you capture the attention of the audience and on how you show imaginative views of the materials and ideas. Overall presentation, 30%. That includes the design related to intent views, the appropriate finish, the balance, harmony, and impression for a total of 100%. All interested participants must submit their entries on or before February 23 at 12 noon. All entries will be posted on our official Facebook page, Sinai Bodies National Arts Month, and will be announcing the winners on February 28, 2022. And now we present to you the winner of this year's Master of Pop. For the third placer goes to... Let me present to you the Tiktok Artista Contest Mechanics and Criteria for Judging. The contest is open to all students of Box City National Science High School. Participants must use the Tiktok app only. One participant, one entry only. The Tiktok Makeup Transformation video should be connected and or touched with the main theme of the National Arts Month 2022. Sini ng the duration of the video should have a minimum of 30 seconds or a maximum of 60 seconds only. Participants have the right to select a song that is related and suitable to the theme. Any devices are allowed to use for shooting and editing for this contest. Entries must be uploaded in TikTok and a copy of uploaded video or the same video must be submitted. Any issues relating to the originality and authenticity of the entry will be the responsibility of the participant. Submission is until Wednesday, February 23, 2022 at exactly 12 noon to be submitted on this email, janasamayp at gmail.com. Rename your file with this format, complete name, underscore your grade level, and your section. Entries beyond the contest duration will be accepted. Will not be accepted. Entries will be judged according to the following criteria. Relevance to the theme, 30%. Creativity, 20%. Originality, 20%. Visual impact, 15%. Technical skills, 15%. A total of 100%. The top three finalists will be announced during the virtual closing program on February 28, 2022. And now, I am pleased to announce our winner support, TikTok Artista 2022. Our third placer goes to... Our second placer goes to. And this year's champion for TikTok Artist 2022 is no other than. Once again, congratulations to all our winners. To those who have not won, do not be disheartened. 
Try again for the next competition. At this time, let us all watch and listen to the full performance of our Bashan Sikat winner. I believe that we couldn't have done this successfully with our judges and committee chair who spared their time and effort in this. Therefore, to acknowledge everyone, may I call in the Muppet Club President, Mr. Christian John Cadelinha. Hello everyone! I hope all who is part of this celebration, especially the Bashans, had a fantastic time. We're all here to celebrate, give life, provide happiness, and enjoy ourselves. And I'm delighted that we've been able to enhance this Arts Month after all the hardships we've encountered. We wanted to preserve, promote, and disseminate Filipino artistic creations, as well as incorporate the arts into communal life and use them as a catalyst for values education. This family is plenty of helpful hands, therefore the aim was never too difficult to achieve. As one of the many honored people who attended this event, I wanted to express my heartfelt gratitude to everyone who worked so hard to make this celebration possible. First, I'd like to thank our school's principal, Mrs. Carmelita C. Valencia, for her unwavering support and love, as well as the Cultural Affairs Coordinator, Mr. Carmel Carmelo A. Hamito Jr., and MAPI Coordinator, Mrs. Amelie A. Babor, for their tireless efforts in making, making this event successful. And also, I would like to thank our MAPI teachers, 
Mr. Marshall Emeria Jr., Ms. Yunisa May Partisino, Engineer Clint L. Conde, and Mrs. Roxanne May S. Tagoto, that have given their all to help and make this event a success by allowing students in Baie City National Science High School to express their various abilities in various activities. Shout out also to the technical team, Mr. John J. E. Villacampa, Ms. Hannah May Tia Kosalem, Mr. Jeron A. Okat, and Ms. Abigail C. Summer. As well as the MAPI Club officers, a big thank you to all of your support and assistance in not just making this possible, but also inspiring others to showcase their hidden talents and skills. This celebration would not have been possible without your efforts. And to the panel of judges, thank you so much for your time and effort for choosing the best winner. Special thanks to Red Calcutta's General Merchandise Branch to Online Shop. And to all the students in Baie City National Science High School, thank you for showing your talents and skills, which made us feel proud and astonished in each and every activity. Keep the fire burning as we aim for a brighter future. Once again, thank you and God bless us all. To officially close this year's National Arts Month, may I call on the vibrant and full of enthusiasm, no other than the Sci High Culture Affairs Coordinator, Mr. Carmelo A. Hamito Jr. Greetings to all and Mabuhay. The nationwide celebration of this year's 2022 events and activities conducted by the Poppy Club highlights the artistic brilliance of the passions showering the best talents, genuine creations, and magnificent productions of various art forms. This may we continually maintain the enthusiasm in achieving our goals in pursuit of sharpening our minds without compromising the Christian values and endure all the hardships that we are about to encounter, for we will bring everything what we sow. Erase mediocrity, and we shall commit ourselves to excellence. Thank you and keep safe, everyone. And that concludes our virtual closing program. Once again, this has been Sulito and George reminding you that your ability to expand your mind and strive for life and learning is critical to your success. By dedicating yourself to learning, you can get ahead in every aspect of your life. All it takes is a, a commitment. commitment. Good, Good afternoon, afternoon everyone! everyone.